feel very excited to share the news with you that I finally got my PMP certification done. Thanks to eduhubspot.com and Varun's mentorship. The material provided by eduhubspot is fantastic and the mentoring is phenomenal. I could not accomplish this feat without the outstanding mentorship of Varun. I would like to thank eduhubspot for all the support that was given to me in this journey. If you're looking to be certified just like me, EDU HubSpot is your go-to place. Thank you, EDU HubSpot, for helping me become a PMI certified professional. I want to give credit to my success to the EDU HubSpot team. So, Joel, congratulations and thank you for joining me in your success party for clearing the PMP exam. Thank you. Thank you, Varun. Thank you very much. I'm I'm so proud of you Joel this is such a great achievement and I know you. you know the kind of hard work you have done so it's it's amazing hats off to you buddy very happy for you thank you very much perfect so Joel uh, before we get started let me tell you a few things um, the main reason why I do this interview is I want to make sure the students who like we have thousands of people who are constantly following us right you know that and I want them to feel motivated that hey you know what Yoel did it Yoel did x y z thing so let me do all those things so the main reason is that the people who are watching this i want them to get motivated spread the positivity around and secondly what were the things which you used which you helped you in the journey and the things which you should not use you know so that they don't make the mistake so that's the purpose floor is all yours talk about your background where are you from and then we we'll take it from there Thank you very much. Uh, I am from Rwanda. I'm now in Kigali. Very nice. Very yeah. nice. So I'm I'm working in the in the Ministry of Infrastructure. Very good. Okay. In, uh, it's a, it's an agency called the Rwanda Transport Development Agency, and it's part of uh, the Ministry of Infrastructure, and it is a specifically for road construction. Okay. So I'm um, in the Department of Social and Environmental Governance. Okay. 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 So, and uh, in most of the times I work on World Bank funded projects. Very nice. Very nice. Yes. In compliance and okay. safeguards. Yes. So you, let's talk about your journey now. What, what did yes. you do? Just let's start talking about that. Okay. Okay. So I... I had the dream of, of uh, doing PMP way back in 2017 when I was doing my master's in mm -hmm. South Korea. Wow. But uh, after exploring and seeing how much work that I need to do to earn the PMP, I was a little bit scared. And I kept on putting off for some other time, some other time, mm -hmm. until, until one of my very close friends is the 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 exam and uh, he had not told me about it okay all i saw was uh, people congratulating him and i said wow i can do this too if if he can do it you can do I, that. I can do it also so i reached out to him mm -hmm. and he told me about uh, edu hub spot mm -hmm. and that's how i i came into the picture and uh, Awesome. contacted uh, you and the process started perfect so i then i then uh, enrolled for the for the boot camp mm -hmm. but after the boot camp i i also somehow stopped a little bit uh, until i decided i have to go in and do this mm -hmm. for good yeah Awesome, awesome. Yeah. So, yeah. so, so you'll. Um, I know it's. Um, you know, sometimes it's a, it's a difficult time. You know, your motivation level goes up and down. So, what were the things which you did to make sure you are always motivated and you have to clear it? Like, did you use any strategies for that? Yeah, actually, what I I did I work uh, I work nine to to five. Mm -hmm. And uh, most, uh, mostly my work is, I'm always very busy to the extent that I cannot get time to, to, re to read during the, the working hours. Okay. So what I did was uh, I decided to, to dedicate four hours during mm -hmm. the work days. Okay. And then I, I woke up at 
for a, a m in the wow. morning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> then I started up to up to seven in the morning. Okay. So that then in the weekends, mm -hmm. I did uh, from from nine up to two p.m. Wow. So it was very intensive. Okay. Yeah, I I wouldn't advise it on anyone because it it requires a lot of sacrifice, which Correct. most of the people might not be ready to. It Correct. was somehow extreme. Correct. So Correct. maybe everyone has got their own way of uh, of arranging things, but mm -hmm. what I can advise: don't go very extreme. Don't go very extreme. For you to keep your 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 motivation high, don't go extreme. Don't go. Take, make, take small baby steps, maybe. Yes. Have a few hours that are very productive. Correct. Good. Good. Yes. Mm -hmm. I always say that you will to my students that, hey, you know what? I just need one to two hours of your time on daily basis, not more than that. And within 30 days, you can pass the exam. I always say this because, you know, the problem is like when you go too extreme, you give up after some time because you cannot consistently yeah. use that. So it's always better take small bites and within a 30 days time frame, just go in and go for the exam. Sure. It also takes a toll on you. Yes, exactly. Mentally. Yes. One friend of mine told me that uh, my blood increased during my journey for PMP. <laughs> 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 Uh, I didn't like it. <laughs> yeah. But uh, all in all, the journey was very informative, mm -hmm. was very challenging, mm -hmm. and you really get to enjoy and after after passing, and you know that really what I invested in has paid off. Correct. This this is more important that all this hard work which you have put into will ultimately get paid off and 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 you know. When you see that congratulations on the screen, it's like the most beautiful thing you would ever see. So it's it's amazing, amazing. So actually, what I, I sat for the exam at home. Okay. And then after after seeing that message, I didn't even wait to 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 answer the survey. <laughs> so I I ran out of the house shouting, and my wife was like, "What is happening here? Are you?" running mad <laughs> wow. wow i mean you deserve it that's how it is yeah. i'll say that you deserve this yes good 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 very happy for you so uh you do you remember your scores in edu hubspot mock test do you do you have like in the mock test the five, the four hour exams how much were you scoring do you remember that yes i do okay. actually i was ranging between 70 55 there 50, 55 to 70? 55 to 70. Okay, 55 to 70 was your range. And and the yeah. reason why I ask this question is, well, EDU HubSpot questions are tougher than the real PMP exam, right? Very, and the very, whole, very. Right, do you, do you agree with that? Yes, I perfectly agree with that. They are very hard. Actually, what I did was I had, uh, I installed the EDU HubSpot application in my phone. Okay, app, okay. And then downloaded another application mm -hmm. so I could just uh, compare the two tests. I do the test in, on EduHubSpot mm -hmm. and then do another test on, uh, on on that application. And and what was the difference in scores? Do, do you remember the scores on uh, The scores on the EduHubSpot were very low mm -hmm. <laughs> the scores on, on another application. Correct, correct, correct. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, Mm -hmm. they, they, I can say, all I can say is that uh, if you, if you take the test and, and get maybe 50, mm -hmm. don't, don't give up. Know that you are, you are in a good range. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Because it tests you and it gives you the strength to, to answer the questions that might come during the exams. Correct. Correct. Yeah. I Another thing. Mm -hmm. I can say, please, 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 don't cram. Because even after, up to now, if you ask me what I answered in the in the exam, I cannot tell you. Mm, yes. So if you do cram, you're really going to mess up. Okay, Just that's understand a, that's the language. 
Yeah. Understand the language, understand the context, and you will be good. Yes. Go. This this is what I tell all my students, uh, Joel. No cramming, no memorization. It's not required. Just understand. Use common sense. Watch the videos. Do the learnings, and that's it. And and the reason, Joel, you know, when you said that you are scoring in fifties, you are good. We have deliberately added tougher questions in our mock simulator because we want people that that they should not feel surprised in the real exam. Like if let's say you would have practice only on that other application where you were scoring very high, things might have been different in the real exam, and you would have surprised. Sure, I wanted sure. to give you yes, that that was the thought process there. Yeah. Perfect. Perfect. Okay. So um, thank you, Joel, uh, uh, for uh, your your recommendation. What are the things which we should do, which we should not do? Uh, like, you know, no, no doing extreme, small bite by bite steps. That's important. Mm -hmm. So let's quickly do this for fun. I always do this for fun, more like one word questions. Uh, so okay. I'll ask questions and you have to give me one word answers. And it's more about your personal life. It's, it's more for a fun, fun side. Okay. 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 Uh, one thing you could do all day, every day. Reading. Reading. Wow. That's good. Yes, reading okay. books. What is your favorite book? Let me ask that. Favorite book. Rich Dad, Poor Dad. Oh, Rich Dad, Poor Dad. That's, that's an amazing yeah. book. I, I love that book. It's, it's a very good book, yes. actually. Good. Yeah. Good. good. Um, your favorite color? Blue. Oh, you're, you're blue? Awesome. I'm, yes. I'm more of a yellow fan. It's, it's yellow, <laughs> yellow army. <laughs> okay. Uh, your favorite day of the week and why? Saturday, because that's the time I get to spend with my family. Awesome. Awesome. That's yes. good. Your least favorite household chore. Your least favorite. You don't want to do it, but you have to do it. You don't have a choice. Well, uh, cleaning utensils. Uh, you know what? <laughs> high five, high five. <laughs> Same here. Before this interview, this is what I was doing. Actually, I was cleaning the dishes and I was <laughs> like, well, I know that. <laughs> but thank you so much, Joel. It was lovely interacting with you. And yeah. I'm, I'm so proud of you, dear. Don't stop here. You are an inspiration to thousand other people. And I'm pretty sure, you know, so many people who would have watched this video, um, you know, specifically from Rwanda, they would have been very, very motivated about this. So thank yeah. you. Proud of you. And for all the people who really need, um, uh, you know, help in the PMP preparation, do reach out to me. I reply to each and every email. I repeat, I reply to each and every email. You have my email address, varun.anand at the rate eduhubspot.com. Uh, it's also in the description on the YouTube box. You can, you know, take it from there. So, yeah, reach out to me or just go ahead and do check out the website, uh, www.eduhubspot.com. And one day soon, you and I will be doing the same success story what I did with Yoel. Thank you so much, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.